Yuma Proving Ground is one of Yuma County's largest employers. There's about 3,000 employees up there. They contribute about $430 million worth of business to the area every year. Yet the road leading to the Army base is far from safe. Turn after turn, Highway 95 is heavily traveled by cars, trucks, big rigs, and other large vehicles. Its two lanes have proven to be dangerous. Seeing a need, the Arizona Department of Transportation has begun plans for a Fortuna Wash Bridge. So what we're going to do with our highway is build a bridge that spans or crosses the wash and lets the water flow underneath. Standing parallel to this train crossing bridge with a similar design. Plans show embankments on each side of the 15-foot high bridge, spanning 650 feet long, 86 feet wide, and four lanes, a median and shoulders, also a concrete side barrier. The project won't happen overnight. ADOT only has secured three of the $15 million needed just for the bridge. We do have partial funding lined up from the federal government so far. What we're able to do is we're able to speed up the design and get started right away. So we're in the process of signing up con uh, consultants right now, engineers, to do the actual design for this part of the highway. The master plan for Highway 95 includes four phases with a projected cost of $85 million. <laughs> Plans include widening Highway 95 to four lanes with a median and a continuous left turn extending to Aberdeen Road, wildlife guardrails, and special crossing for military vehicles. ADOT is looking years ahead. Well, what we're going to be doing with this highway is, is first of all, increasing capacity so it can handle the higher vol volumes of traffic that we're seeing. Since 1990, we've had already an increase of 45% in traffic, uh, so the added lanes will handle that capacity. Paving the way for the 25,000 vehicles expected to cross this highway in 2023. For News 11, I'm Anna Corpus.